welcome to today's lecture video today we are going to see the strong and weak forms from uh, module 4 uh, what is a strong form and what is a weak form the original pronunciation of a word is called the strongest form or the strongest pronunciation of a particular word and uh, when we speak every day when we speak faster the strongest form derives and takes the weak form of the word take for example i will come okay when we speak it in a daily conversation we say i'll come so the shortest uh, form of will is will. okay the derived version or the short version of will is ill so likewise likewise uh, we have a weak form for so many words in english and it is very important to understand them because when native speakers speak they didn't uh, pronounce everything um, very strongly so we should not mistake it in order to get a clarity of it we should have uh, um an idea about what is the weak form and what is the strong uh, strong form of a particular word so let's go and check out one by one the first one is <coughs> a a uh, pencil a uh, rubber when we stress certain thing oh yeah when when do we use the strong forms and when do we use this weak forms whenever we want to stress a particular thing okay whenever we give an import whenever we give importance to that word in a particular sentence at that time we use strong form take for example i am coming meaning uh, right now i am coming so whenever you want to just say right now i am coming you uh, uh, stress that word whenever you stress the word you uh, pronounce it in a uh, full form but whenever you don't give importance to these forms they uh, you use weak forms okay what are the words that have weak forms okay uh, articles prepositions conjunctions not conjunctions uh, pronouns they all have uh, weak forms likewise be verbs auxiliary verbs modal verbs they all have weak forms let's go and check them one by one a pencil and a uh, becomes a i got a new dress it is not a new dress a new dress i have got a new dress got a, got a. so it is the smallest of am okay am becomes um or um i'm coming i'm coming you don't say i am coming you say i'm coming or i'm coming i'm coming okay next one and becomes an that's an apple when you say you don't say an that is an apple okay you say that's an apple an apple okay it is an article so it takes a week for next one and becomes and or Mm, un or sometimes in take for example i want salt and butter mm, salt and butter okay next one any becomes any do you have any money any money okay any becomes any and all becomes a they are at school okay all is the full form but they're at school they're at school okay uh, it must be abbreviated when we use it in a weak form version next one as becomes as okay it was as it was as good as an elephant or it was sorry it was as big as an elephant okay at becomes at she works at night b becomes p he is going to be late be late okay next one been becomes been have you been here long okay have you uh, have you been here long or have you been here before 
bot becomes but actually the pronunciation here is a uh, but it becomes at and one thing i would like to mention here is all kinds of r sound long r sounds or a sounds a sounds whenever they take um weak form it becomes the smallest a sound take for example it has to be but but it becomes but can a sound becomes can could u sounds becomes could do u sounds becomes d her a uh, a uh sounds are as in should birth it becomes a uh, her okay so let's uh, check out the examples for becomes for it is a present for her it is a present for my dad for my dad okay from becomes from that's book that books are from india from india you want to say from india okay from india i had okay it's not had it when it takes shortest form it's either takes had or ad or d okay i had a core when i was at university okay next one has becomes either is as or z is been here for years is been for years okay next one how becomes is most of the times is as we saw in the previous sentence uh, here okay it's not here okay ah uh, yeah i'll add lunch yesterday i heard lunch yesterday okay next one he becomes e or he for example she she thinks is handsome is okay is instead of he it becomes a okay and next one him becomes m you don't fully pronounce it as him you pronounce it as m i have given it to him not him i have given it to m i have brought him a chocolate okay next one his become is that is a last chance that is last chance next one i becomes a i wish i had a, i had gone to bed earlier i wish the first one takes i because uh, whenever we use it in the first uh, in the beginning most of the times we tend to pronounce it correctly but in between when we talk faster it becomes a uh. next me becomes me must becomes must take for example you must come you don't say you must come you must come right next one of becomes a okay or of. that's part of of the problem okay next one or becomes a or becomes a okay it's our problem it's our problem she dropped her coffee in our mug okay next one shall becomes shall shall we go for a dinner she becomes she okay she's gone she's gone should become should some becomes some become some some sometimes some okay next than becomes done or then the becomes the them becomes them okay i have dropped them or sometimes um just this um we have dropped we have dropped them we have dropped them okay there are there or there to becomes to to i have given it to him to him not to him to him as becomes is or is was becomes was or sometimes is we become just we okay and where becomes uh, uh who becomes who will becomes ill would becomes 